In this video, we will cover licensing VLink Virtual Matrix. To use VLink, you'll need a valid license file. Obtaining one is a simple process. If you're ready to purchase VLink, you can do so through RTS. After your purchase, provide your system ID to receive your license file. If you're still considering VLink, don't worry, we offer temporary licenses for testing purposes. Finding your system ID is straightforward. Just log into the system administration and navigate to the license section. Each system ID is unique to the server on which VLink is installed. This step remains the same whether you're setting up a new installation or expanding an existing one with additional ports. Once you have your license file, uploading it is quick and easy. Simply click on the Upload License button and select the appropriate file. The system status page will then display details about your license. Should you need to transfer your VLink installation to a different server, RTS is here to assist you. Contact your RTS representative and provide them with your current license information along with the system ID of the new server. They will guide you through the process, which involves invalidating the license on your old server. This action alters the system ID of your old server, rendering the old license file invalid and VLink inoperable on that server. In the event of a server failure preventing these steps, don't hesitate to reach out to your RTS representative for support and guidance. Thank you for choosing VLink Virtual Matrix.